why has it come to this? Has it been a PR failure? Julian, let's let's be clear. You're putting words into my mouth by saying uh, we, we're claiming innocence. What we have always said is that 1MDB is a company that has faced challenges. These are primarily business challenges, and those challenges started in November 2014, a confluence of three events, right? Well, the, if you're not innocent, you're guilty, right? Uh, again, you are innocent until proven guilty. And what 1MDB has always said publicly is that we will cooperate with every investigative authority and that if any wrongdoing is found, then action must be taken under the purview of the law. If uh, you had done the right thing and communicated well, why are we in this situation? So Julian, between uh, 2009 and January 2015, which is when I took on uh, the role, I, I fully accept that things could have been done better from a communications perspective. Uh, however, as I'm sure you will admit, from January 2015 onwards, uh, we have been extensively engaging uh, with the public. Now, unfortunately, the 1MDB challenge, which is a business challenge, was and has become politicised. Uh, and when politicians jump onto the bandwagon, when they use sound bites without reference to facts, and when they make allegations without offering proof, that is sexy and the press laps it up and reports it as such. Our challenge is to ensure we can explain uh, our position. Uh, but you know, frankly, facts are boring and people turn off. Uh, but this is why I'm here with you, for example, to show uh, and to explain our position. Individuals that were originally part of 1MDB, uh, individuals within 1MDB, individuals that were investigating 1MDB, are now no longer there. Now, is there an invisible hand moving uh, to remove these uh, actors? Again, I think, I think I've said this before many times, I'm not a politician and I do not represent the government. Uh, I can only speak from the perspective of 1MDB. Uh, from our perspective, we have always cooperated uh, to the extent possible with the relevant authorities uh, and we've always maintained that if any wrongdoing uh, is found, then action must be taken under the law.